So this effort's a larger effort of uh, K-State participating in Recycle Mania, which is a 10-week competition uh, between universities, colleges nationwide. Um, we've been doing this program for three years, and uh, currently K-State is fourth out of eight in the Big 12. Uh, we're doing all right right now, but we could, uh, and we have been doing well, uh, but we could definitely do some more. So. He and I worked together to put together the grant proposal, and then uh, we found out a few months later that the proposal was approved, and we were approved to receive a little over 5,000 recycling bins uh, that we could give to each individual student, um, or in the apartments, each apartment, and that way it'd make, a little bit, uh, make it a little bit easier for students to recycle. And, uh, the ones that have been distributed so far, students have been using, they like them, makes it a lot easier for them to uh, recycle, both taking it outside, which is what they're primarily for, but also for the door-to-door -door, uh, Collection programs that some of our residence halls use. So I think students are pretty excited so far and I think the more we get out, uh, the more students will have the opportunity to use them. Um, it's a great opportunity for students to, to uh, engage in recycling. Uh, never before has it been easier now that we have bins in the rooms that students can put their recycling in there and then at their own time uh, go and sort it outside um, and contribute uh, in reducing the waste and impact um, case that has on the campus. And you know, we really want students to maybe get into the habit of recycling now so that when they move off campus and they graduate and they live in a community, that they get into those habits. Uh, it will never be easier than it is now, uh, but hopefully we can get them in the habit and they'll do it long term.